それは未来を取り戻す物語「フェイトグランドオーダー」Hello, everyone. Welcome to another day of Fate Grand Order. I got an. Oh, one sec. Let me clear my throat. <clears throat> I just said apple juice. Never drink apple juice before doing video stuff.、Uh, I got an alert on my totally legitimate phone. I'm totally playing this on.、Uh, that there is a limited time present because it's been a thousand days. And today is March 21st. I get 10 Saint Quartz. As a prize, also my login tickets and stuff, but I'm, 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 that's, that's a good thing, but where are they? No,、oh, maybe I can't use them yet. I remember seeing something saying, like, you have to complete、um, Singularity F, so we're gonna focus on that. Also, yeah, another one of these. I'm gonna keep getting the proof of the heroes, because then I can just keep giving them to,、uh, to Mash there. Because I think it says. To get your. As is March 21st, that's today, 1000 days have passed. Campaign summary. You have to clear that. Okay.、Um, by the above date. So I have. I have. A bit of time. Let's hope. Hopefully I can get it.、Um, you will not receive the presents if you do not log in. Well, I've logged in, but it's a case of I gotta complete it. So.、Um, we will also do an enhancement here. Because I did get that one、uh, level up. So I have three here now. Who can be enhanced in their skills?、Uh, people I will never use. That's okay.、Um, otherwise, it's all about the same. But let's see if I can increase the level on. Because I got a bunch of.、Um... Okay, these ones are. For anyone, right? Like, what level can I get you to? I'll get you to 21. I kind of. It'd probably be a good idea for me to keep leveling up Archer. Because for now, he is my kind of go to, right? Well, first off, wait, wait. I have my free roll for today. Let me get that free roll. So let's get that first. Because if I go to my summon here. I almost, I almost have enough for another full 10 roll. Because I have 24.、Um, I don't want you. I want this.、Um, Saint Quartz Summon, that's the story one. Friend Point Summon, I get a free one. Let's use this. I don't think it'll be anything amazing at all, but let's see. I'm just going to click through. Yeah, we're good. Oh, we got、uh, a rash. I better get some.、Uh, Some, some, some lotion for that. We got、uh, Mephistopheles. I've read his story. You're so generic. You look like a protagonist for a harem anime. And that's not a compliment. That's not a compliment. You look terrifying. Okay, so the, the, he calls himself an Akuma, which is a demon, but that's different from devil. Like, you're kind of different. A devil would be better, but that's fine. He's not the devil. Mephistopheles is. That's fine. I know about him. I read his story there in、uh, university. Okay. So we are going to level up Archer first, because he is my go to right now. Um, so, I'm going to give him these three.、Um, and I think I've played. Let's just go default. Because、um, then we got the one. Where's the foo that we got? Where did it go? Where'd foo go?、Uh, but that turned him off. I want to go all off except for Fu. Right? Cannot select. Oh, because it's for caster. Okay, I see. Okay, got it. Got it.、Um, so we won't give him the Saber class stuff because that is specifically for a Saber. We do have an Archer one. Do we have any other Archer stuff? Let's go with 
not for if we turn off different class nice we can it'll just tell us which ones we can use so you know what let's sacrifice him for the big exp up yep that's good i mean it's just worth it for them levels because like yeah that's that's a big boost there now um it'd be a good idea to also increase it for you now there aren't ones that are diff not a different class so i think we can kind of give you whoever's right like the riders i'll give to rider but i don't have a caster i don't have assassin i don't really use berserker so we'll give you kind of whom's evers right i'll bring you up to 18 that's that's pretty good more hp is worth it yep because yeah it's it's very clear you want to use the one of their symbol to get them to level up for for what you want um and then you know what because we can i will give you your rider ones so we're gonna go whoops we're gonna go filter turn off a different class so we can go yeah that that'll be worth a lot more probably double from normal how much you got level 18 not bad we're getting there to get your uh, get your ascension righto 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 and oh wow you got up to 25 actually don't know how that worked but sure um in fact you know what let's give it a go let's try to do saber wars again this time with a stronger set of characters we get our guest servant so we're gonna go um line up we're gonna move you back there this is still good here okay let's give this a go this time i'm gonna skip the opening and we'll give this another try because now a i understand the combat more b we're way more leveled up and c i know how the command seal works people were, or people were telling me about how okay you know you they, they work on a real 24-hour scale you can use them for spells in battle or you can waste all three if you end up team wiping to get your whole team back perfect now i know i was worried there'd be some like deep consequences to using your command spells but much like in extella it's a very temporary one so let's do this here i'm gonna save for um for my uh for my stuff here okay so let's get crit stars up let's just go all out to begin with except i won't use defense up and invincibility i'll go evade up because then there's no point to then using yours right now so we're gonna hold off on you so let's start with buster actually we could do a full combo with her that's good let's go um quick no let's go because i don't know if her noble phantasm ra raises so let's see here how's this gonna do i'm on big damage that's already really good damage. Okay, so she got her fire support up. And we evaded those because we're sick. Um, we can do full combo with you now. Okay, attack up plus three, then extra. Yeah, definitely a lot less damage, but more than before. Wow, we're doing a lot better. Okay, that's good. He was stunned there. Okay. A little ouch. Okay, so let's, uh, because this goes by. So, okay, we're gonna heal you. There you go. And, uh, apply evade. Let's apply evade to. You're mobile, but we can still let you do evading. Okay. So you're stunned. Oh, great. Awesome. Love it. Oh, this is sick. Okay, well, not much we can do about this. Yeah, well, that sucked. Well, it's a good thing we made you evade. Okay. Now, she's stuck, but that's okay. Um, hmm, okay, so she does get it still. Okay. Okay, there we go. Now, that charge is up, though. I'm worried about that. Okay, yeah. This is her noble phantasm again. That's rad. That's rad. Don't kill him, please. Oh, he's super dead. Okay, so we're gonna have to get lucky. Okay. 
let's see here. Sub- Oh! Oh, they come in if they die! Well, shoot, that's good to know. I didn't even know about that. Okay. Let's pop on... Invincibility for you, because then you can get your Noble Phantasm, as well as Defense Up for everyone. Okay. Well, that's good to know. And Attack Up? I'm gonna... Do we have... We only have... I'm gonna save it till we get three Saber Lilies in here. We'll go Buster, Quick Buster. Sure. Okay, good damage. Oof. Good. Okay. Um. Uh, no, not yet. Okay. <clears throat> I want to get your Noble Phantasm, so we can go Buster, Buster Arts, and that should hopefully... Oh, but I could have done three, three for that, but that's okay. Oof. 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 It's all around, boys. Um. Okay. Oh, this sucks. Oh, this sucks. Oh, this ain't good. Um, we're definitely going to need to use a Noble Phantasm here. Okay, we're going to go... Okay. Oh, we're getting there. If, as long as Lily survives, we'll be able to do a Noble Phantasm after this, I think. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Caliburn, Buster, Buster. This should be it. Attack up. This is gonna do it. Oh, we're on fast forward. Well, we'll see this go by a little quicker than normal. Cool. Cool, sick. Love it. And that's it. Nice. Oh, we barely won, but we won. Complete 10 requests. Well, we got one there. How much are we going to get? Oh, not that much, actually. We did get a gold saber monument. Very nice. Well, that's passed. I'm sure the rest of mid the missions in this will be just as easy, he said through his teeth. I wonder if this follows the same sort of structure as uh, as other event quests that I've played, where it's like you do a couple missions, then you kind of go into, a, like a couple story ones, and you go into an endless cycle where you build up the resources. I think it is. That was a pretty good for a warm-up match, if I have to compare, yes. Just like warm-up exercise. That is to say, you're all still novices, like preschoolers who can't even wake up in the morning. I think we got in some pretty good blows. That saber even blurted out some oofs. Right. When my hand slipped and accidentally hit her in the shin, she kept saying it doesn't hurt at all despite the tears welling up in her eyes. <laughs> no doubt, she's an Artoria. Foo -foo. No, to be honest, I was holding back. I didn't ambush you from the dark. Bury landmines or kidnap anyone important to you, did I? Oh, well, that certainly was a fair and square fight, very much like the Saber class. By the way, who are you anyway? If my eyes were not mistaken, you came out of that rocket. <laughs> Thank you for finally asking. I'm Herewin X. I'm the Saber of Sabers. I'm the ultimate Saber. I am the one and only Holy Sword wielder in this universe. A one-for-all kind of Saber. Really? Based on that tracksuit? Who knew you were someone that amazing? The Saber of Sabers. So you're a grand class? Oh wait, but your class is... That's a new thing. Silence. You call yourself Shield or whatever, but as a freshman in the Fate world, you cannot see the truth. What you can see with your eyes is not all that there is. To get along in the world, sometimes you must turn your eyes from the truth and let it remain ambiguous. Everyone with your look is a saber. <laughs> a master that understands. Very nice. It's Hero in X, right? Explain why you attacked us so suddenly. After that, I would request that you leave immediately. We are busy with Lily's training. You've hit the nail right on the head, Shieldy! I told you that I'm the ultimate Saber class servant, right? She's not even Saber class. From where I stand, I cannot overlook that feeble Saber there. I have a very important mission, though I cannot speak of it. At any rate, you call yourself Saber Lily, right? What you need now is a special training and a teacher you can respect. That's right. That's why I'm training with my sword. I said that you need a teacher. You require the help of a great senpai that's fought many years as a Saber. Therefore, you're quite fortunate, as expected of me, the one with A-rank luck. 
What I, Hero in X, hide is my first class saber teaching license. It was fate, ha, huh, that forced Deuce Stallion II to crash land here. Let me show you, I'm a first class saber. All right, I don't really understand, but sure, I'd appreciate it. Nice answer, I like you. Let's get started. I should now explain exactly what kind of training you shall undergo. I have a huge smile on my face. You will gather three kinds of materials that possess mysterious powers which are spread across this world. They have fallen from my spacecraft. If you don't gather them and repair it, I cannot return home. Wow, it's certain from outer space. You can't return home. I feel so sorry for you. All right, leave this to me. I need to gather materials and repair that vehicle, right? Right. I'm usually not one to trust others, but since things are generally going my way, I'll let it slide. Now I shall tell you the true details of your training. This spacecraft will probably summon a large number of monsters. It is a very out-of-place object. It's an upart. That's about all I- Wait, there's about as much wealth here as all of England. Therefore, it is obvious that the huge mobs will descend on it to make it their own. Your job is to fight these lawless bands, defeat them, and gather super particles called Altrium. Should be Artorium, but... Altrium are energy particles that present through the universe. It seems impossible. If we can get some, I can make this work. You there, shieldy master. You're not going anywhere. It's too late, so give up. I thought we could have made it if we left now. Yes, New Year's vacation still isn't over. This is a pretty rough turn of events, senpai. At any rate, once you gather enough Altrium, I shall power up Lily by myself. Explanation complete. If you want more details, then gather spacecraft materials and Altrium. From now on, we must be fierce as demons. We will cut down all saber faces we run into. They say it. Even if they're not saber faces, just looking like one is also a sin. So we'll cut down the likes of Jean d'Arc too. A saber's dignity rests on battle. Experience and learn this. Now begin your warrior training, Lily. Now begins a crazy battle that's supposed to help Lily. Foo foo. Amazing. Amazing. So we get the Altrium. If we work on it, we can um, get one of them, I'm pretty sure, though. How much, we'll have to see. Well, hey, we got a Saint Quartz, though. That's the important thing. So, okay. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, okay. Let's see here. Monster attack. God, this Star Wars music is hilarious. So, let's see here. Experience gathering novice. So there's still five days remaining, so we can we can come back and work on this after, and I can work on that in my spare time. We do need to complete the Fuyuki City one to get our ten Saint Quartz, so we will go do that. Mash's training. Let's go do that. Uh, so there's a Saber class. Saber is weak to uh, Archer. Well, we can get another one of those. We'll grab... Oh, wait, we already have Kahulin, so yeah, we'll throw him in. Um, okay. Well, you know what? Let's, uh, just for the sake of... They're about the same. So let's put them both in. Um, because we're, we're, we're practicing on getting some of our characters leveled up. So let's have them go. Section 8, main story, Mash's training. Uh, hey, Tanner. It's pretty obvious that Kiri Light's looking depressed. You are her master, aren't you? Do something to cheer her up. Oh, do I need to do a mana transfer? Uh, could it be... Yes, I'm ashamed to be the one to say this, but... Um, under your command, Senpai, I've gained enough experience. And yet, I'm still unable to unleash my noble phantasm. I don't- I'm like a defective servant. Foo! Oh, so that's what's bothering you. You have such a strong sense of responsibility, Mash. But I don't think that can be settled overnight. After all, it's a noble phantasm. If a rogue spirit seeker weapon can be mastered within a day or two, then servants wouldn't be that special anymore. Of course we can master something like that immediately. After all, heroic spirits and noble phantasms are the same thing. If the young lady here can fight as a servant, that means at the very moment you can use your noble phantasm. And yet you can't, which simply means your magical energy is not circulating right. Alright dude, mana transfer time, get on her. Let's see, maybe enthusiasm? No, perhaps too reserved? Anyway, I'm sure it's because you just don't yell out when you practice. R really? Really? That's a Japanese thing. It doesn't work in English. We can't do that. Fa! Hey, don't yell all of a sudden. You're gonna burst my eardrum, seriously. Sorry, Director, but Caster said we should shout. 
No, that was a metaphor. Well, at any rate, I see you have enthusiasm. Danner, you heard the young lady. Do you mind if we take a quick detour? Uh, don't tease Mash. She's an innocent girl. What? I'm just talking about special training. It won't take long. I'm a caster right now, so leave the healing to me. First, we'll start off small. Let me inscribe some misfortune bringing runes. Okay, we're done. Huh, what are you doing? Why are you inscribing runes on my coat? Even if something targets you, you can just take care of yourself, right? And look, here they come. I don't know what you're talking about. Director, get behind me. You two, Senpai, prepare for battle. Alright, that should be enough. To put it simply, a noble phantasm is part of a heroic spirit's instinct. It's hard to use if you think too much. Therefore, you must first use up all your energy, young lady. Man, I'm a genius. Uh, maybe you're an idiot? Oh, that's it. No reply? He doesn't even- he doesn't even say that's not the case. I like that. That's good. Okay, so. Let's get through this, and let's get her training done. I will say, it's the the amount of, like, writing is way higher than I expected. Like, there's way more talking about what's going on. Um, well, first off, we have, uh, let's just use up yours first. Yeah, just use up your stuff. Yeah, there's, there's way more talking about what's going on. There's so much more, you know, story. That's why when I saw, well, they, you know, they're adapting an entire, you know, uh, singularity. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a bunch of enemies. I was like, why is it only one battle? Um, that's why when it's like, yeah, we're, we're, we only adapt the one singularity for each, um, you know, like, uh, section there. I'm like, that doesn't feel like enough. But now that I see how big each singularity is, it's like, that makes sense. And, uh, so, right now the anime is based on, like, the eighth singularity. I did some reading. That's pretty crazy. That's a lot. Um, but, uh, eh, you know what? If, if, if that's what people are, like, you know, excited for and enjoying, then for sure. I'm happy that I will be, you know, playing through this. I don't know if I'm going to go, you know, keep this kind of up. If I might do a singularity, take a break, do some more fate. I don't know. We'll see. Um, the Saber Wars event, people were like, oh, I, I know why Tanner's playing now. It's because of the Saber Wars. I'm going to be super real. I didn't even know that that was going to be going on when I started this. The actual reason is kind of weirder. Um, so if anyone's watched my um, Stay Night stuff, you'll know that I have crazy dreams and that the dreams are connected to fate a lot. I actually had one where I, uh, I was in Grand Order um, and it was an amazing dream. Like, I was in it. Like, not playing it, I was in it, right? And so, once I had that dream, I said, you know what? Let's do it. Let's play some daily stuff. You know, play for about an hour each day. Don't put in money. That challenge failed. Uh, but just, you know, play for a bit each day and see how it goes, right? So, we'll see if I do kind of a singularity and then go back. I might do the first two because I already know what the second one is. Oh, this is a bunch of them, huh? Because there's just going to be a bunch of training here. That's fine by me, really. Um, but, uh, yeah, so for me, it was, um, that, that, that definitely helped me to sort of want to play this. As of right now, part one has not gone up yet. I've talked about it on my Twitter, though, so people know. And I've, I've, uh, in one of my, uh, Fate Zero commentaries, I said, if you want more Fate content, you're getting it, so... They, they they know at least oh boy there's a lot of enemies here huh so like yeah if I want to use a command spell I can increase noble phantasm by 100% fully restore or I could use I wonder if there's more you can get later that'd be interesting um okay let's go I want to end with buster you know what let's just use that okay because then, yeah, the last one gets the big ups for stuff, so... 
If I can get uh, his Noble Phantasm, I could probably deal some good damage. Well, there's only a, there's only five enemies. Um, okay. Yeah, that the resist really resists. Um, the matchups are way way more you know apparent in this than I feel in other media. Like, you know, I'll play a game or something, it'll be like, you know, um, you know, something is not very effective. Ah, you can still brute force it, right? But here, it's like, no, no, the, the matchups seem really important. They can make and break a match. Okay, um, let's do that. Let's see if we can get some big damage. Yeah, like, like, even that resist should have done way more damage, but... That's fine. So the charge is for their Noble Phantasm, it seems. Because I noticed that as soon as that charge went up, um, it was their Noble Phantasm. So, uh, Mysterious Heroin X, rather. So I guess that, that must be what it's for. Um, which is a problem uh, if it were to hit. So we're not going to let it happen. That should just do a big combo, Ryder. That's a sick combo. I like that a lot. Okay. And like I said, I, I'm 90% sure that that exact combo that she does is literally her combo in um, in Grand Order Arcade. Like when you're like every attack that they have here, because in that game you have the cards pop up, and I didn't know that you could click on them to sort of choose your order, and that would like queue up your next three attacks. It's a really cool system, right? Um, so I would instead just kind of mash, haha, <laughs> puns, uh, which definitely led to some problems with, you know, some characters and not understanding how it goes, but yeah, it's fine. Okay, if this is just doing these over and over, I'm gonna cut ahead, because boy, there's not much else to do right now, so until the next story, I think we're just gonna fast forward a bit. Hey, we got a bond level up. Server profile has been updated. A new voice has been added to my room. Cool. Well, that's good to know. So that's what that does. So we'll go see. What does it mean to add a new voice? Is it literally just that now he can speak to you in your room? Because if so, okay. That's fine. I mean, I don't think... Is that even translated? It's not translated. It really doesn't matter. Unlockable voice clips is something that has never appealed to me in any sense in any game. Yeah, let me just try this. My room. Let's see here. So, like, okay. Wow. Okay, that's kind of crazy. Um, let's see. Is it Master Prof? No, not Soundtrack. Is it Master Profile? So I'd have to go through. Um. Okay, well. No. Wait, what was that? How do I switch who's in here? What was the other one? Okay, what's the other one? What was your one about the color? Ah, oh, there's a lot. Ah, oh, there we go, that's why. Okay, because right now we're... We're partners. And then I can forget about her later. Okay, well, let's, uh... Let's continue here. Just wait, what, what are my... My extra missions here. So I have to just complete. Yeah. So I just gotta keep working on that. And the rest are probably just clearing the, the missions. Okay. 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 Let's continue.
Oh, hey, there's a story for this one. I can't go on any more back-to-back -back battles. I'm sorry, Caster. Rather than test my will, please teach me some solid theories. You just don't get it, do you? Did I miscalculate? Oh well, let's cross that bridge when we get to it. Okay, I'm your next opponent. You don't have to hold back because we're allies. I'm not going to hold back when I kill Tanner. Oh, hey, what? What are you talking about? Are you crazy? What does Tanner have to do with this? A servant's problems are the master's problems. Didn't I mention you share the same... Fate? <laughs> You had the same thought, right, Tanner? When the young lady can't stand anymore, it's your death. Master, please stand back. I, I won't be a hindrance for Senpai, I won't. That's what I like to hear. Alright, let's have a real servant battle. I was wondering why I couldn't select him for this mission. I was like, huh, weird, maybe he gave up. But it's like, well, that's why, because we gotta... We gots to fight him. So we'll see how that goes. It's a good thing I picked a, uh... Picked an assassin as my partner, just in case. But we'll see. We got a right boss battle now. Though I'm sure it's going to be roughly the same as normal. Alright, buddy. Yeah, you got a bit of HP there. So let's see here. Let's start by paralyzing you. Yeah, there we go. Uh, and then I don't need to use any of those. So let's go with... Uh, let's get some of our stars going. Right? Do these quick chain crit stars gained. Because then if we do Buster next, we'll deal the big damage. If we got Busters. We do have Busters. Ooh, I like those. I like the odds on that. So we're going to start with... No, we're going to go... Buster. Arts Buster. There we go. Because that should deal big damage then. In fact, we did him in one to two turns. Sick. Sick, sick, sick. That's me using my noggin, folks. I'm so smart. More, more QP. More QP. Okay. Well, how was that for training, you big dummy? I bet you we're gonna unlock our noble phantasm at the very end of this. <sighs> okay, it's time to finish this. Burn to the ground with your master. My spells, the coffin of flames, a giant of verdant thorns, retribution, the forest that will purify human misery. Befall the wicker man, and behold, as good and evil, bite Zadusto! Ah, I must protect. I must unleash it. Everyone will, even if it's fake, even if it's just for now. I have to unleash it properly or everyone will disappear. Uh... Did it work? I'm noticing a lack of CGs in this. There's no CG art. Is there CG art later? Yo, hey, Noble Phantasm Unleashed. Lord Chaldeus. Oh, okay. Increase defense for three turns. Effect increases with overcharge and apply incoming damage. Oh. That's a defensive one. That makes sense. In Grand Order Arcade, what it would do is you would use it, and everyone, because it's a 3D like fighting game, everyone behind you would um, would be protected for like 30 seconds. They'd be invincible. But one, if you're playing single player like I was, there's nobody to be behind you. And two, using Noble Phantasm takes about three seconds to unleash. By that time, most servants will run right past you. So it's like, it's probably good for like co-op. Be like, guys, get behind me. But if you're playing with randoms or computers, you're screwed. Um, yo, Mysterious Hero and X will pop you in the party, even though I won't be using you myself. Oh, I, I, did I manage to unleash my noble phantasm? Ugh, I knew you'd survive that. But I never thought both you and your master would walk out without a scratch. Be happy, wait, no, praise her, Tanner. That young lady there is without question a first-rate heroic spirit. Senpai, I... just now... Oh uh, yeah, that was amazing, Mash. 
That was surprising. I didn't expect to unleash your noble phantasm that soon. Ash was never someone with a strong will. That's because you got her all wrong. You may call the young lady here a protector. There's no point in teaching a bird to swim, is there? You have to teach a bird how to fly high. Although, she didn't get to obtain its true name. Right, even though I can unleash my noble phantasm now, I still don't know its true name, nor the true name of the heroic spirit. That's fine, even if you are inexperienced. Even if you are only temporary. Your very wish unleashed your noble phantasm. You didn't have the slightest desire to obtain a true name, to become one of the chosen, to become a true heroic spirit. That's why your noble phantasm responded. Oh, what an inspiring story, just like a fairy tale. A uh, director? Don't mind me, I'm just teasing. I'm pleased that you're able to use your noble phantasm now. But it's inconvenient to use it without a true name, right? I'll think of a good spell for you. Since it's a pseudo-deployment of noble phantasm, let's see, let's call it Lord Chaldeus. Chaldea is the name that has meaning for you, too, so to activate your spirit origin, that's a good spell for you, right? Yes, thank you, Director. Lord Chaldeus. Yeah, I like it. That fits you perfectly, Mash. And the desire to try it out after getting it is only human nature. Caster, would you be Mash's sparring partner? Yes, of course. I was holding back before, but even so, her defense was impeccable. As someone with more experience, I'll hammer the basic and noble phantasm into your head. Tanner, young lady, you ready? Yes, please. Okay, well, let's give it a go. I wonder if she'll start with 100% or if it'll be like, no, you gotta get her up. Will the mission even work if you just don't use it? I don't know. We'll have to see. Avengers are effective against rulers and weak against moon cancers. I mean, everybody knows that. Oh, uh, boy. It uh, can be enhanced by completing rank-up quests or interlude. Rank-up quests, that's something I saw. I don't know what that is. It's gonna be interesting. Should we start with a hundo? Let's see here. Nope. Well, guess what? I can't even... Well, you know what? Let's try and get hers going now. So let's go... Um... Let's start with some quicks here. Just at least to get a... Uh, get some stars and stuff. Okay, good. Oh yeah, he's going in now. Um, okay. Well, that's again, better than nothing. Oh, we're just gonna straight up kill him. We're just gonna kill him before we even get the chance, huh? Well, that's fine. Oh, wait. Watch him just keep evading to get our NP up. Probably not gonna work. Um, I don't have any spells or anything I can work here, right? HP? No, not really. Okay, well, let's just go. Just murderize him. Chirp. Dead. That's fine. Watch it be like, no, you didn't use it even. It's like, okay, cool. <laughs> Great. Uh, we got five. Uh, caster pieces. Good. If we want to upgrade a caster, we can do that. But we won't be doing that right now, because I don't really have a caster just yet. We'll see in the future. Boy, oh, these load times. How come loading visual novels is apparently a lot? That's so weird to me. I guess it has to load kind of everything into its RAM, but I don't know. I guess it also has to connect to the servers and back. What do we get? Ooh, an all Ember of Wisdom. I'll take that. Pop that on someone who needs it. Unknown coordinates XG. Mobile coordinate NZ. Whoa, ooh. There's different ones now. Um, what's down here? Free quest. Oh, that's just a free quest. But this one is the main quest, the Dark Cave. Ooh. If I'm correct, this is where the story ends, because I did this in the arcade. Uh, oh, I have four now. Who else can I skill up? Um, yeah, no, I'm not skilling up any of you dudes. I, why would I even do that? So if I want to get it for him, I need I need another archer token. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Um, Well, let's use that Ember of Wisdom we got, though. 
enhance. Let's, uh, let's put that on Ryder, actually. Because, again, I want her to level up. Whoops, didn't mean to double-click her. Let's go. Yeah, well, we got a Ryder one. Would that be Max? Really, that's it? Are you for real? Can I even put... What if I put her? How much is it? It's a lot. She has three stars, but that's not worth it. For that amount? No. Wow, okay, I guess she's at the point where you need a lot. Because, like, we're going to use that, and it's not even going to level her up, right? Yeah, it's super not worth it. Okay, well, never mind that. Because if I want to ascend her, can I do that? Like, like I have enough of those. I just need... Okay, well, I'll be for the future. Well, wait, um, don't I still have the friend points for I got for logging in? You know, like, we'll get that after. Because if we finish this mission, and we get this St. Quartz, and then we get the St. Quartz for completing it, I think we'll actually have enough to get our 30 roll also. So, because how many do we have right now? Let's see. We currently have... About, like, 26, right? 25, okay. Okay. So, and then if I need more, I have the four on the main field here. I have the one, two, three. Okay, okay, yeah, we'll have enough. Okay, well, let's start with the Dark Cave. We'll keep grabbing Koo Hulin, even though we're not using him. Section 9, the Dark Cave. Uh, when you, when every single party member is incapacitated, using a Saint Quartz to restore everyone is kind of crazy. I don't know about that. Because that is, I mean, I get, I, I guess, also Spirit Origin, okay, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. But I guess, like, it's a, that's a lofty cost, really. <gasps> Yo, it's one of the classic Skelemans! I love you! I missed you so much, Dragon Tooth Warrior! We'll do a, extra, a super big combo here with uh, Emya. Also, they just straight up spoil who he is right there, huh? I, mean, I, I get it, it's legacy, but it's still surprising. Now, you're pretty beefy. You're a beefy boy. We're gonna go... Uh, let's get that, get that, that. Okay. Yeah, you're, you're done. Alright, what do we got now? Now we got... Ah, more of them. Yeah, they're they're stronger. They're level 15, so that makes sense. Um, let's go. Buster. No, Buster. Quick Buster. That should be good. Because I think I think that will kill him right here. Yep. And then Buster. Good. Okay. Yeah, it's start it's starting to reach that level of actual difficulty, which is good. We're gonna go. Um Quick. Right, let's just kill him. Yeah. And get some big noble phantasms. Let's see how much we're gonna do. Okay. Yeah, that just barely killed him. Okay. And uh ooh, well, I wonder what we're gonna use. I will go you. You you. Okay. Should kill him. Yeah, yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, you're done, Zo. Nice. It's interesting, it's like we just go in the cave and do it. And also, anyone who's play anyone who's either played or watched my Stay Night, or, you know, watch the Heavens Feel movie, you look at this cave and go, oh, I recognize that cave. The cave's layout in the arcade version was kind of really interesting. It was the final area of, you know, where the stuff goes down, but, like, the layout was kind of cool. It was, like, a big circle in the middle. It's like a big donut, almost, but you couldn't go up to the middle of the donut, so it was actually a really cool arena, because your opponent could be hiding behind it. I thought it was real neato mosquito. Okay, moving on to the next battle. 
Noble Phantasm gain from damage. Noble is also gain when you take damage. Properties Mystic Codes by... Okay, well, we'll be going to that later. We don't have Mystic Codes yet. Five command cards will be dealt each turn from a 15 pool of three servants. After the pool of 15 has been exhausted, the pool will be reshuffled, and five will be dealt from a new pool of 15. Okay, that makes sense, because different characters have different, like, card, you know, kind of readouts, so you want to look at the synergy for that. I'm not at that point yet. I do not have enough, you know, choices to do that yet. So, I wouldn't worry about that right now. Again, we'll try and get your Noble Phantasm going. Well, whew, you killed him already. Oof. Oof. Okay, we'll go... Triple Basta! It's the big one, Basta Wolf! I'm actually really amazed at how MASH deals damage. Like... Not not in terms of how she uses a shield, that makes sense. Any anime thing can can come up with a creative way to use a shield. But in terms of like she actually like How can I put this? She's a good damage giver outer for a character you'd look at and go, no, you are a you know, just a pure defensive character. She's way more balanced, you know? But it makes sense for being kind of a, a main yes. character you'd want to do that. Also, yeah, you're super getting a ton of Noble Phantasm, bud. Nice one. I'm gonna wait and just use it the next turn there. Um... Now we'll go with the Triple Buster. Though I don't think we can exceed 100% with you yet, because you have had yours, uh, yours kind of up. Alright. What do we got for the last one? Ah, two Dragon Tooth Warrior A's. They got big swords this time. So we're gonna go... Buster. Buster. I sadly can't go Buster, Buster. Wait, can I go... Can I go Buster? Quick, Buster? Will that work? Let's see here. I really wish it would just keep playing his theme. If... If that is something worth that you need to upgrade to get, then I would oh, gladly upgrade. I do like how it does hit both, too. That's really good. Wow, you survived that, huh? Not many dudes survive unlimited blade works. Alright. There's no real reason for a brave chain for this, but I'll take it. Just for them. For them. Well, because I, I keep saying for experience, but I guess there is none, huh? It's just like, like the experience is doesn't doesn't change depending on what you do. It just it just happens. I think we got one more before the big thing. I think. Let's see. It's very. You guys are getting a very different experience now that you see I have a mouse. Because I'm not one to leave my mouse. I'm one to move it around. I trace it while I read. I normally hide the mouse, but for this, being a mobile game, I think it makes sense. Quest progress, we got one more. So, that's just a... That's a little... Little tanner factoid for ya. And the Greater Grail's back here. It's a little far back, so don't get lost. This place looks like a natural cave. Did this always exist in Fuyuki City? Probably. It's half natural, half man-made. It's the underground workshop expanded by mages over a number of years. Anyway, Caster, I forgot to ask you something important. Do you know Saber's true name? It sounds like you fought several times. Yeah, I know it. Anyone who gets hit by a Saber's noble phantasm will find out that bastard's true name. The other servants were all defeated because Saber's noble phantasm was that powerful. Powerful noble phantasm, is it? What was it like? The sister sword of the sword in the stone. It's the most famous sacred sword in your time period. Its name? Sword of Promised Victory, Excalibur. Oh, wait. Wielded by King Arthur, the proud king of knights. <gasps> Yo, Archer. Uh, speak of the devil, or shall I say the faithful follower. As always, I see that you're still the loyal knight. Yo, look at this design. Yo, that's cool. It's Emya hair and a bow and arrow? Oh, yo. I don't remember becoming a follower of anybody. I'm just here to chase away unwanted visitors. In other words, you're the gatekeeper. 
I don't know why you're protecting the saber, but let's end this here. Isn't a game that never ends boring? For better or worse, we need to move the pieces forward. From the way you talk, I think you understand the circumstances. Yet, you are still absorbed by your own desires. You still haven't changed despite being a mage now. In that case, I will knock some sense into you. A uh, big talk for a mere archer. Hey, why are you just standing there, young lady? He's an archer. Without your shield, I won't have time to cast my spells. Right. Sorry, I was out of it for a second there. But no problem, I can do this. When it comes to guarding, leave it to me. Oh boy. Yo, that's a cool design for Emya. Like, it's... It's like the, the short hair of Emya. It, that's a good way of making like an Emya, like a, a Shiro costume for Archer. Because they are quite different. So, like it looks almost more like a, like a halfway point between, between him becoming, you know, Archer there. I like it a lot. Okay, well, we, we need to go full irony. And I want to finish him off with, um, with Unlimited Blade Works. We're already at 20%, huh? Very nice. Nice, 14. Good. Oh, they hit. Oh, they hit hard. Okay, um, let's go. Ooh, that resist ain't good. Um, oh, that's, it, they, that's a resist, so I'm not going to do the resist. So you know what? Let's go down, up, up, like that. That should kill him. Because it's not going to hit him. Oh, but if I did the other way. Oh, well, no, it's okay. We're good. Nice. So you do get Noble Phantasm for getting hit, which is nice to know. Um, Buster. Arts, arts. Big damage. Nice. There we go. There is way more strategy to this than I honestly thought there would be. Like, really, there is. Okay, nobody still uses the swords. Okay. That's just in the art there. Okay, well, I'm going to slow it down because I want to see what he looks like. Um, let's go... Quick Arts Arts. Let's see how much we can get up from this. Hopefully enough. I guess he uses the exact same one. That's just in his art. I wonder if that's a costume you get for him. Maybe. I still love Over Edge so much. The Fatal Battle music is real good. Okay, that looks to be just Archer's combo, so I think it might just be a costume over Archer. Um, sure, let's do this. If we can get our Noble Phantasm up, we can throw that on and see what that looks like. Okay. He's nearly dead anyways. That's a shame. I want to do Unlimited Blade Works on you, bro. I want to get the irony going. Well, there we go. Thank you. Okay. I'm going to heal you. Nice. First aid. Okay. And let's pop on, I guess... Put that on you, because then you can get yours after, just in case. Okay, well, let's go Buster, Buster, no, I, I want to, I want to, no, 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 we'll do this, Buster, Buster, Blade works, probably won't kill him, just kidding, it's super might, aw, oh, rip, well, he won't die by Blade works, but they will, I am, I am the bone of my sword. So as I pray. Unlimited Blade Works. It's a bit of a shame they don't do the whole thing. They do it really well in um, uh, Extella because they're, one, they have enough time. It's a Muso. It's single player. It's like whatever, you know. So they, they go through it, but the words pop up on the screen as it, like it does a circle around him. Wow, that didn't kill him. Wow, that's kind of surprising. Uh, but it's sick. Also, hey, Noble Phantasm. Let's see yours then. So we're gonna go, uh, Lord, uh, yeah, Lord Chaldeus. 
Art Buster. Let's see what it looks like. Okay. That's a little boring. That's a little boring. I mean, I get it. It does exactly what it says, but it's kind of really boring. Okay. Hey, how can we get so many turns? Okay. Um. Quick. Quick. Ah, uh, uh, should we get enough? Because quick should kill him here. Or not. I'm stupid. Okay. Last one. Yo, these Dragon Tooth Warriors are more of a problem than than Shadow Archer was. That's a bit of a shame. Okay, we're gonna go... Oh, hmm, I wonder who will get the attack here. Now we're gonna go like that, because I want to just deal damage. Now that I know the different attacks are different types of attacks, it definitely makes me think more about what I'm doing. Um, you know, the high damage, medium damage, low damage, you know, high noble phantasm gain, medium or low. It's like, it actually, now I look at it and I understand, like, where, well, the strategy is. Hey, we got some archer ascension pieces, huh? Hmm, I wonder how many of those we need for our archer. I want to make him ascend higher. Well done, Mage of Flowers. Who knew your her noble phantasm could be utilized that way? Oh, well, rip. Wait, was that disappearing or was that dying? Hey, it's time for you to take a hike. The young lady and I will take down the sacred sword. I'm glad that you trust me, but do you think I can guard against it? I've heard about the sword of King Arthur. My fingers are trembling. It seems too much for me. So people told me that um, Mash, their shielder, was originally like a Stay Knight era design to be a rival to Saber, who had like, you know, the sword that cuts anything versus the shield that blocks anything. So this is cool. I like how they're doing this. Well, you'll just have to overcome it with courage, but from where I stand, you seem to be perfect for the job. That shield will never shatter. You're to lose it. Become the young, it was be, it would be because the young lady messed it up. Let go of that shield, your master behind it will evaporate instantly. Listen, don't think about beating the sword. All you need to think about is protecting your master. That's right up your alley, no? Well, anyway, leave it to me to finish off Saber and just do what you need to do. Right, that advice will be great help. And just hold the shield. Don't let go of the guard button. It's like a fighting game. Don't let go until you know you have an opening. That's the best advice I was ever given for fighting games. Just don't let go of that guard button until you know it's safe. Facing the Greater Grail, we still got three more. Jeez, okay, well, um... Sure, let's do it. I want to finish it today, because I want to get some of those other things done. It's probably just going to be some, uh... Some easy-peasy missions we don't have to worry about too much to begin with. Yeah, just gonna deal with some... Some Deuterinos. You can further increase the level of a servant who's reached Final Ascension. Okay, that's what that is. Got it. Makes sense. Thank God I love when games do this. You can, like, click to advance. Like, I know how to do that. Um, but I like this. It's always a good thing. Though I think it might actually... I think it might actually make the loading take longer. Okay. So we go. Uh, do this. Okay, once again, I'm going to uh, fast forward till we get there because this is just going to be basic battles. Oh, hey, we're back to story. All right. Time for the Greater Grail. This will be our last break. Is there anything you've left undone? It's not like I can explore around and find items, dude. Wait, maybe? Can we go back to the base first? 
If it's necessary, then by all means, we're attacking a bear and its source. We'll need plenty of supplies. I don't know what you're talking about. Whether we forge ahead or go back, we need to rest first. Doctor, are you checking vitals? Tanner looks paler than usual. Uh, yeah, this doesn't look very good. It's because of the unexpected servant contract. You never used your magic circuits, and now they're running at full capacity. It's probably putting stress on your brain. Mash setup camp. It's time to make warm tea with plenty of honey. Yo, that's what I like! Got it, Doctor. I think tea time is a good idea. Oh, feeding yourselves for the final battle? Or maybe I'll go hunting for some wild boars. I'm sure there aren't any around here. Besides, forget about meat. If you must get something, make it fruit. Are you a one of them vegetarians? I'm stuffed. I can't believe you had dried fruits with you, Director. Again, your level of preparation astonishes me. I just happen to have them. Citrus is effective against headaches, but that aside... Uh, what is it, Director? The work you've done so far has been passable. As the Director of Chaldea, I have to give you credit. Hm. What's that look for? I'm sure it's a fluke, but right now, you're all we got. What I'm saying is, keep it up, and you might hear praise from me yet. I know that even a third raider can do first-rate work. Well, well, admitting that Tanner did a solid job. Have you eaten something sweet? Romani, if you've got time to be flapping your gums, use it to send Tanner a supply or two instead. I would feel bad if someone failed because they were ill-equipped, especially when they have been doing their best. What's this? Feel bad? How kind of you, Director? Does this mean you're finally opening up your heart? Idiot. I mean pitiful, pathetic, you couldn't even tell that. Well, I never grow tired of watching young men and women interact. Although when it comes to young women, Director, you're not really... Is that right? Certainly the Director is older, but I feel we have similar tastes. I feel affection for, for her. What are you going on about? I told you before that you're all just tools to me. Mm -hmm. There, see? Even the shadowy like monster thing agrees with me. Huh? Mesh, hurry up and get rid of it. It's gonna eat me. It's gonna eat me. Vor? Vor? Probably not. That's hilarious. Oh, man. These characters, they're fun. Even if I still hate the director, she's kind of a kind of a loser. Don't like her. It's it, it also if her name was just Marie, it'd be fine. But her name is Olga Marie. It's like, no, no, don't like that. I know a few too many Olgas. You're not my favorite type of people. So, um, okay. So, like, there's no way to switch out your servants, is there? Like, your sub-servants? I don't think you can. That's interesting. Well, okay. That's fine. Um, you know what? Let's see if we can get your noble phantasm up, because I want to see it. See how it goes. You do have the, the boost for it, so... Wow, you're not very strong. Well, no, you did, you did about 3,000 damage. That's not too bad. I also need to watch last time I let um, MASH pass out, and I'm like, mm, I should probably watch to make sure that, that doesn't happen. Just for the fact that it's not good, probably, for relationship points, I think. I'm not even sure. Okay. Be nice if we had some uh, some characters that could just heal, but that's not really a thing. So have you kill him? Yeah, like that. The difference in damage between a Buster and an Art is actually huge, to a point where it's almost surprising. You know what? Let's let's go with all three of them. Okay. Boy, Emya gains the um, the Noble Phantasm way faster than anyone. I wonder if that has to do with his uh, skill there, or his his um, craft essence rather. Yeah, let's just get that going. Let's get Noble Phantasms for everyone. There we go. Alright, we'll check out Medusa's on this one. I mean, we know what it is, but I want to see how it looks. We're going to turn off the battle speed. So we can do... Bellraphone. Quick. Blade works? Sure. Double up. I will. I will let you. That's good. That's good. I like that it uses uh very similar to the animation from um 
the uh, Stay Night there. That's good. But it doesn't get its own theme. I am. Uh, like, imagine having such a baller Noble Phantasm, it starts to play. You know, when people first said it, they're like, you know, really, if you think about it, his Noble Phantasm is the Emya theme, because whenever it plays, he wins. Um, you know what? Yep. Yep, that makes sense. I'll give it. I've seen enough to be like, yep, that is what it is. 19 crit stars. Dang. Everyone's gonna get a crit next turn. We got Zahando over there. Or Zaharm, rather. Yeah, like, look at this. Boy, I sure wonder if we're gonna get some crits. There we go. Let's at least try and get uh, Mashes up to use that, too. Oh, it also helps that we do have the thing that boosts the number of crit stars you get, so that makes sense. Okay. So let's go... Lord Chaldeus... And then Buster Buster. She doesn't yell its name. Which I would help me to know how to pronounce Chaldea, Chaldeus. I'm still not 100% sure. That just barely killed him. I got some goo on my mouse, and I don't know from where, so I'm gonna scratch it here. But it sucks, because to scratch, I have to click down a key. So if something pops up in a second... No, we're good. Um... Da -da 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 -dum. Uh, see, I hate it when it's like this, where it's like, I don't know what to do. Well, I, okay, I can do this, for sure. You really want that noble phantasm back up, don't ya? Yeah. He comes in and slashes. He does a little bloop. Okay. Um, let's go. That'll probably kill him. No, we're gonna go with that. To... No, 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 no. Sure, this should work. I'm trying to think strategically. Yeah, because then I thought that would take two. And then our strongest one, which is Archer, he'll do this one here. That is the big damage. Though not enough, it seems. And just finish it off. There you go. Go, Ham. Yeah. Even when in regular speed, the attack animations are really fast. Which makes sense for Fate. They're basically Dragon Ball Zing around at times. Okay. Going. We got some caster up. We also got um, an assassin skill sphere, which, eh, cool. Not gonna super use it, but I don't really have an assassin that I, I love yet. That'll come eventually. I'll get there once I start getting more of them. More of them good rolls. I think we're about to do it. And we got a Saint Quartz. Very nice, very nice. I'm sure I can go back and do these these missions here. Oh, Grand Order. Yep, this is it. So, get Koo back on our team. And if we're fighting a Saber, it's a damn good thing we have an Archer. Section 11, Grand Order. Yep, look at this area. This is the Greater Grail. It's an ultra okay. It's an ultra superior magical reactor. What's it doing on this island nation in the Far East? Gordon Ardata is built by an eminent family of alchemists called the Einsburns. Well, apparently, they didn't belong to the Mage Association. Were solely made of homunculi. Sorry, that's it for the chit chat. The lady has noticed us. <sighs> it's her! Unbelievable magical output. Is that really King Arthur? 
No question. She seems to have changed somehow, but she's the King of Britain, Arthur, wielding the sacred sword. Her gender's different than legend, but she had her reasons for dressing like a man in Camelot. I mean, you can't assume the throne unless you're a man, right? She must have had to pretend to be a guy for family reasons. I have an idea who's behind that. It's mentioned in the legends, but Merlin really does have terrible taste. Ah, ah you're right. I thought that person was a man, but it's a woman. Don't be filled by her appearance. She's a monster. Her power's not made of muscle, but a ridiculous amount of magical energy. Oh no, she should be muscle. Every single strike is massive. Not paying attention, the top half of your body will go flying. Basically, just think of her like a human rocket. Understood, I'll fight back with everything that we've got. Good, if you defeat her, the anomaly in this town will disappear. Listen, that includes both me and her. After that, it's your job. I don't know what will happen, but do the best you can. I see. You've got an interesting servant with you. What? You can talk? You're just maintaining your silence all this time? Yes, and you were being watched the whole time you were chatting. I merely acted as a scarecrow. But, it's interesting. I'm curious about that noble phantasm. Be ready, strange girl. This sword shall test the truth of your shield. Here she comes, master. Yeah, let's fight together! Yes, mash Curie Light, here I come! I too yell my full name out when I'm going to do something. I mean, it's fine because she isn't a heroic hero, as I thought, but... Also, mash totally means Matthew. Don't like that. Kino, 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 that's sick. Sick. We got a cutscene. Well, that confirms that that can block that. Sick. Excalibur Morgan. Like Morgana? Oh, interesting. Interesting. Hmm. I don't think that name was actually said in Stay Night. Though I do hear there is some elaborating on um, Saber Altar in Hollow Atraxia, which I will get to as soon as I finish Grand Battle. I'll get to as soon as I finish um, Zero there. Alright, let's start with the... Uh, attack it doesn't matter when we don't have Buster. Okay, we're gonna start by uh, yeah, applying some Mind's Eye. Yo, wait, is this a remix of... Is this a remix of the opening song? Yo, sick. Okay. Get some arts up for everyone. Using use an archer here is gonna be my best choice. Buster up. Uh oh. Oh, sick. Yo, that's just a stinger. Yo, she just has stinger. I know. Um, Saber in the fighting game has Dante's Helmbreaker, but that's sick. Okay, we're gonna go. Quick, quick, Buster. Use that. Get, get some, uh, get some drops up. God, I wish that was me. Rad. Okay. Oh, that's just a stinger and it's rad. Um, we're gonna pop on the invincibility on you, because then I want your noble phantasm up. And we do have busters, so now we're gonna go with attack up. Who do we have busters for? We do have a buster on you, so let's do that on you. Good, good, good. Okay, we're gonna go. Use. Like Hi. that. See how much we're gonna do. Oh, you're done, Zo. If not this turn, the next one. Oh, yeah, you're super done, Zo. 
That was one other thing I noticed, that when I played the arcade game, like, this was the final battle here, and that's why I was like, man, like, am I spoiling something for Heaven's Steel? Because I knew the existence of Saber Altar, but I didn't really know about Saber Altar. Um, so I was like, am I spoiling something? And it turns out I kind of did, but it was all super, like, I have no idea what's going on. But, um... When I got to her, I'm like, this is the boss, there's like a little cutscene and stuff, and it was, I was like, oh, this is like, she's super easy compared to some of the other enemies. <laughs> Alright. Battle, finish. We did it. Take that. Take that. We got some saber pieces. I like how they're just like, they're the little chess pieces from the credits of, um, Fate Zero there. Which I'm sure are used in other scenarios to represent, like, the battles and something, you know. Like, mm, let's place them on here to represent the Holy Grail War. Unbeknownst to me, my powers weakened. I stayed my hand at the very last moment. I was going to defend the Holy Grail to the end, but I lost because my tenacity wavered. Ultimately, no matter how my fate changes, I will always meet the same end if I'm alone. What's that supposed to mean? Bastard, what do you know? Eventually, you two will realize it, Ireland's child of light. Grand Order, the battle to obtain the Holy Grail has only just begun. Well, that's where the name comes from, I guess. Is that a Saint Quartz? Can I take that? Hey, wait, what do you mean? Whoa! Oh, crap, am I getting sent back too? Damn it, I don't like this, but whatever. Kid, I'm leaving the rest to you. There's a next time. Try to summon me as a Lancer. I like how he's like, damn it, I don't want to be a wizard. Confirming both Saber and Castor have vanished. Does that mean we've won? Yeah, you did a fine job, Mash Tanner. The director must be so pleased. Hey, where's the director? Grand Order. How did the servant know that name? Um... Orders, please, Director Murray. It would be curt with her, huh? Oh, right. Well done, Tanner Mash. Several points are unclear, but let's call this mission complete. First, let's retrieve the crystal. It's the reason Saber became abnormal. It's clearly the reason why Fuyuki City became a singularity. Yes, an immediate retrieval. What? Well, I didn't expect you'd get this far. Beyond my plan's expectations and my own tolerances. I don't know who this is. Master Candidate 48. It was my mistake to naively overlook you as an improbable child. <gasps> You're the bad guy, Professor Lev! Lev? Professor Lev, you say he's there? Is that Romani I hear? So you survived as well. If I told you to come to the command room immediately, or I told you to come to the command room immediately, but it seems you didn't listen, honestly. Trash, you can't even follow orders. Just the mere sight of it makes me want to throw up. Why is it that humans always try to avoid their preordained destinies? I knew with hair like that you were not human. Master, fall back, fall back, please. That person is dangerous. The, that isn't the Professor Lev we know. Lev, oh, Lev, Lev, you're alive. Thank goodness, without you, I don't know how I could protect Chaldea. Director, don't! That man is... Oh my god, look at this literally cg art. Hi, Olga. You seem well. Looks like you had a rough time, too. Yes, yes, that's right, love. The command room blew up, the city's in ruins, and I can't return to Chaldea. I'm going crazy from all these unforeseen complications, but it's okay as long as you're here, we'll be fine, right? That's how it's always been, right? You'll help me this time, too, won't you? Yes, of course, honestly. All these complications have irritated me. And the biggest complication is you, Olga. I set the bomb right under your feet, let you st yet you still live. What? Lev, what's that supposed to mean? Sorry, you're not actually alive. You're already dead. Your body, at least. Long ago. Trimagestus thoughtfully transferred you into this land after you'd become... residual thoughts. You had no aptitude for ray shift while alive, right? You can't teleport while you have a physical body. Understand? You only gained the aptitude you so desired after you died. That's why you can't return to Chaldea. The moment you do, your consciousness will vanish. What? I'll vanish? Wait, I can't return to Chaldea? Indeed. 
but that's too sad a story for you. Let me show you the fate of Chaldea that you devoted your li entire life to. Is he showing us his magic ball? What is that? Chaldea says bright red? It's a lie, right? It's an illusion, right, Lev? It's real. I've connected the dimensions for you. Having the Holy Grail allows me to do so. Now behold, descendant of Animosphere, behold your folly! Wow, that's a lot of teeth, sir. Not a sliver of blue representing human survival remains. Nothing but a bright, burning red. That is the outcome of this mission. Isn't it wonderful, Marie? Once again, your incompetence has brought forth tragedy. Don't, don't be so absurd. I'm not responsible. I didn't fail. I'm not dead yet. Who are you? What have you done to my Chaldeus? It isn't yours. Honestly, what an annoying girl you are. Something's pulling my body across space. I told you that place is now connected with Chaldea. I could kill you now, but there's no grace to that. I'll grant you your final wish instead. Go ahead and lay hands on your treasure. Think of it as benevolence on my part. Wait, what do you mean love my treasure? You mean Chaldeus? No, stop, please. Chaldeus? A high-density body of data? A territory of dimensional anomaly? Yes, no different from a black hole. Perhaps a sun. Well, either way, a human touching it would be a hellish disintegration on a molecular level. By all means, have a taste of infinite living death. Yo, remember how I said I don't care for Olga Marie? I take it back, that's too far. No, no, someone help, help. I, I don't want to die here. Because I've never been praised. I've never been praised by anyone. Why, why does this always happen to me? No one ever valued me. Everyone hated me. No, stop. No, no, no. I haven't even accomplished anything yet. From the moment I was born, I've never been accepted by anyone. This is really sad. Director! Oh, Ripperoni. That's a rough pass. Oh, don't do it, Senpai. If you approach that man, you'll die the same way. Uh, impress uh, impressive for a demi-servant. You sense that I am a fundamentally different life form. Shall I reintroduce myself? My name is Lev Liner Floros. In charge of the year 2017, sent to dispose of you humans. Oh, wow. Are you listening, Director Romani? As a friend who studied magecraft, let me give you some final advice. Chaldea's finished. You humans have reached the moment of your destruction. Professor Lev, no. Lev Liner. What do you mean? Is it related to being unable to see 2019? It's not related. It's the reality that this is the end. Unable to observe the future, you babbled that it had disappeared. That was truly wishful thinking. The future didn't disappear, it was incinerated. The moment Chaldeus was dyed crimson and red. Your end is certain, your era no longer exists. Chaldeus' magnetic field may be protecting Chaldea, but anyone outside of it will face the same fate as Fuyuki City. So that was it. We didn't lose contact with the outside world due to interference, we simply lost the outside world itself. Oh man! You really are perceptive. Shame I didn't kill you immediately. But that too is feudal resistance. If the time within Chaldea passes 2018, it'll be wiped from the universe. No one can change the outcome now. This is a rejection of humanity by human history. You didn't perish because of your inability to evolve, nor did you perish due to a war with foreign species. Rather, it was from your own foolishness, your incompetence, because you lost the grace of our king. Who? What? Like a bunch of worthless scrap paper, you'll be burned away without a trace. Ah, it's the, sing the singularity at its limits. Cursed Saber, if you just obeyed, you would have been allowed to live. Even when given the Holy Grail, she caused trouble by wanting to sustain this era. Farewell, Romani, and you, Mash, candidate number 48. Believe it or not, I have other things to do. My enjoyment of your destruction ends here. Now, but be swallowed by the dimensional warp. But I'm not that evil. I'll allow you to say a final prayer. The underground cavern's collapsing. No, the cavern wasn't stable in the first place. Doctor, perform an emergency ray shift. At any rate, we can at least save Senpai. Understood. I'm already doing it. But I'm sorry it may collapse faster than I fix it. If it does, then do what you can on your side. I mean, we can survive in a space for a couple of few dozen seconds, right? Sorry, but please shut up, Doctor. I'm so mad I'm about to lose my cool. Just hang on to your consciousness. If we don't lose that, I might salvage. We won't make it. 
Mash, you at least. Senpai, your hand! Yo, yeah, Rip Fu. Fu's super dead. Fu, more like. Fong. Hey! Alright, you're a good boy. Want something to eat? Nuts or maybe fish? I hope she's talking to me. Hmm? Not sure if you are a cat or a squirrel, but that's okay. You are pretty cute. Foo, cute, cute. Ah, the hero's awakened. There, there. That's how a main character should be. Good morning, Tanner. You're conscious now. Who are you? Even though I already met you, but... You're not thinking straight yet. It's the first time we've spoken directly like this. What? Are you shocked that you woke up to the sight of such a beauty? I understand, but I'm used to it. I'm Da Vinci, a Chaldea collaborator. Or perhaps the third summoned heroic spirit. Anyway, we'll talk later. Someone's waiting for you. Go to the command room. Someone's waiting? Roman? Roman? Roman's waiting too, but he's not important. Jeez, there's someone else. She's the important one. Guess you're not used to being the main character yet. Foo foo! See, this little one says so too. Come on, time to get up, Tanner. From here on, you'll be the center of the story. The choices you make will probably save us all. Just like the multitudes of brave souls who weren't remembered by history as they saved humanity. You've been given a role to fight, not as a hero, but as a human walking the path that was preordained by the stars. Hey, there you are. Good morning, senpai. I'm glad to see that you're okay. Oh, good morning. Thank you, Mash. I should be the one thanking you. I was able to stay conscious thanks to you. Uh, I'm all for your reunion, but could you bring your attention here, please? First of all, congratulations on surviving and completing your mission, Tanner. Well done. While the situation was forced on you gradually, you bravely faced the challenges and overcame it. That earned my respect and appreciation. Thanks to you, Mash and Chaldea were saved. It's a shame about the director. We've got no time to hold a service. All we can do is grieve. Ellipses. Listen, we must defend humanity in the director's place. That's how we pay our tribute. For some reason, I seriously thought that her soul would go into Fu and that, like, Fu would become the director. This little Sundere fox and I want to die if that would be the case. Thank God not. I got the report from the crystal from Mash and what Lev said. In Chaldea's state, what Lev said was true. You can't contact the outside world. The staff who left Chaldea have returned. I fear humanity has already been destroyed. Chaldea may seem to be the only place outside the normal timeline. Perhaps it's staying on the timeline right before the collapse. Think of it like a colony floating in space. The outside world is dead until we do something about the situation. Okay, that's pretty... Is, can, can we, is there something we can do? Of course. First, I want you to see this. We tried scanning Earth with the, the resurrected Sheba. It's the Earth of the past, not the future. The beauty singularity was destroyed thanks to you. But we hypothesized that the future was unchanged due to another cause. The result being... Okay. This distorted world map. A newly discovered a dimensional disturbance against which Fuyuki pales in comparison. They say change in the past changes the future, but you can't overthrow the future by slightly altering the past. History has the power to heal itself. You might be able to save a person or two. But at the end of that era, we'll still end up with a definitive result unchanged. These singularities are different. These are humanity's turning points. What if this war didn't end? What if this naval voyage wasn't successful? What if this discovery was wrong? What if this nation couldn't become independent? The ultimate decision point to determine the current state of humanity. Destroying them is like causing the foundation of human history to crumble. That's what these seven singularities are. The future had already been decided when these seven singularities formed. As Love said, humanity doesn't make it to 2019. But we're different. Chaldea is yet to reach that future. Do you understand? Only we can fix this mistake. Now we have a chance to return the singularities normal. So here's the deal. Ray shift into these seven singularities and get history back on track. It's the only way to save humanity. However, we're still powerless. All the mass candidates are frozen. Mash is the only servant we have. I realize you're being forced into the situation. Even so, I'll say it. Master Candidate 48, Tanner. If you wish to save humanity, you wish to have a future beyond 2018, then you alone must go and face these seven singularities in human history. Are you prepared to do this? Can you shoulder the burden of Chaldea and humanity's future? Of course! I can do that! I'm the main character! Thank you. With those words, our fate <laughs> has been decided. They use that so much in this, that word. 
We'll now carry the preservation of humanity as laid out by Olga and Marie Animosphere, former director of Chaldea. Our objective is the protection and recovery of human history. Our search target will be each era's relic and grail. Our opponent is history itself. Any great historic, historic spirits and legends will stand against you. Challenging them is an act of blasphemy against the past. Save humanity, we must defy human history. But this is the only way to survive. It's the only way to take back the future. No matter what sort of end awaits us. To reflect our determination, we shall abandon the original mission named First Order. This is now Chaldea's last yet original mission, the Grand Order. Wow, we got the names. In the name of the magical world's highest order, we will take back the future. Yo, for real? I'm amazed at the story of this mobile title. Wowie wow. There's a lot, and it ain't bad. It's definitely not, you know, stay night level writing. But it's not bad. Singularity F. Foundation restored, order complete. Cool. That's like an MMO screen. I think I got that in the arcade version too, but I couldn't read it because it wasn't Japanese, and I cannot read Japanese. Wow. That was a delayed anime opening. Bond level up. Well, okay, so she's a story-type Bond, I guess. And what do we get? Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh! Sick, we get- that's it. Fate's done. We got the Holy Grail, guys. Cool. Kahulin has been sent to your box as a present. Sick. Uh, unlock the ability to register favorite servant. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, we just got him. Cool. Welcome to the team, buddy. You're three stars. It kind of sucks, but hey, cool. So there are some story ones you get. That's good to know. So, uh, you know what? You're a good caster, though. So we'll use you for a bit. I want to be like, damn, am I a caster again? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, he hates it. Wait, okay, hold up. How can you remember? There's got to be something going on then with, with this thing, because he shouldn't remember us, right? I thought they get their memories wiped, but... That's fine. They keep that for, 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 for the funsies. Yeah, gimme, gimme, gimme. All right, so first singularity, Hundred Years War of the Evil Dragon Orleans. Okay, well that's the next one. Okay, complete first singularity. Okay, so that's the next one. So we got ten. So guys, it's time for a proper ten roll. Ooh, ooh, I'm excited. Mmm, mmm. Come on. Come on, Saber, Saber, Saber. Saber, 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 let's go. Let's go. 30 Saint Quartz, we got this. Let's go. I'm feeling it. I'm really feeling it, Mr. Krabs. I'm really feeling it. Come on. Okay. Oh, fill my soul with good luck. A rank luck. I am... I am Archer. I am Shiro Emya. I will use my luck. I will gain my love. Okay, well, that's just a regular saber. Oh, hey, it's Jider. Hey, hey, what's up, dude? I know you. Your eyes are small. I don't know how to feel about that. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's just another silver ring. I hate you so much! Oh, I hate you! Come on, I'm guaranteed at least a four star. Please don't be him again. Oh, hey, it's Bedivere. You're a man, but your voice is very feminine. I like you, though. I like you, though. Come on, I'm holding my entire body in place. Okay, we got the Holy Shroud of Magdalene. I don't know what that's about. That's my four star, though. Please don't be my only four star. Come on. Hey, that's a nice one. We get one of, uh, Mits, 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 what's her face? The character who really isn't much of a character. Ooh, Zelrekt, cool. Nice, nice, nice. Come on, please. Ooh. <gasps> 
Oh. Fine. You're not even the cool Lancelot. Another one of that. You're not even the cool Lancelot. I'll take a four-star Lancelot. I'm on a level five. I don't have a single level five. Why are we getting so many true shots? I'm not happy. That's fine. We can work hard for at least Saber Lily through the uh, through the event there. It's gonna be Caesar again. No, it's another Fergus Machroict. Okay, well, at least we got a four-star Saber. Oh, it's weird. It's weird to have you being normal. Yep. See, that's a much more male voice compared to the voice that was in... The voice that was in Dean Stay Night, that was literally the most female voice you could possibly give someone. Servant Saber, Lancelot, Sanjou Itashimashita. I don't like his art. I don't like that sketchy art. It's not the best, but... Okay. Well, I think with that, guys, um, I'll be doing some of those bonus missions off camera. But next time, we're moving on to the Hundred Years War of the Evil Dragon Orleans. Like, France. So, boy, if you guys wanted more of me speaking French, guess what? You're going to get it. Thank you, guys, and we'll see you next time for some more Fate Grand Order. Ciao.